hello friends welcome to my channel in today's video i will show you how to connect with uh, postgres and load your ga's data onto postgres uh, let's start go to pg admin 4 for postgres open it as soon it opens just right click on server postgres 10 and create database just name it nyc or anything you want to name it just save it in database list just now you can see there is nyc click it and you see database is connected go to extension and now you can see there is only one extension available uh, what we need to do we require a post gis extension and post gis topology extension here for this i write a query create extension this is post gis and then create extension and post js underscore topology uh, these are mandatory uh, requirements on postgres to upload your gis data on postgres just run this query up uh, refresh and you can see there is postgres and postgres topology extensions are available here now just go to schema public and here in tables you can see there is only one uh, special reference table uh, available here uh, now i would uh, up upload data into postgres using post gis uh, application just start post gis application it's post gis 2 in my case uh, view connection for this you need to connect with post gis uh, give it username usually it's postgres by default then password what password you selected at the time of installation then there is nyc database uh, on postgres click ok and see the connection is successful now add data uh, I upload data from my local system. Is vector data available? I would like to upload country shape file, countries shape file. Select countries and open. It's open now. Click on import and it will start importing the all data to Postgres. Now, data is imported. Now refresh it and you can see there is a country's uh, shapefile data available here. Just make it, just, you can see its column, country, English, French names and also. Now I will show you how to access query your data. Uh, I just write a simple query of select country that is uh, a column name from countries uh, shape file actually i just run it rf5 and you can see the list of all countries which are available in the shape file hope you learned something new out of this video please subscribe to my channel thank you